you believe it? It's August already. I don't know where the year's going. Now, I realize I just had a birthday, and I know they say as you get older, it goes faster. But this year, I think it's going faster than ever. Spring didn't arrive until June, and all of a sudden, we went into summer, and in Wisconsin, they're having cool nights again already. So, you know, it's going to be a short summer. But August is here. It's the lazy, hazy days of summertime. This is the month that you're supposed to have fun. I know that July was my birthday month, and I know I partied the whole month. Actually, I partied six weeks. I feel if it's your birthday and you got to go through it, you might as well enjoy every moment of it. But August is the best month of the summer. The kids have gotten all their vacationing out of their bodies. They've been off to sleepaway camp. They've seen Grandma and Grandpa. Now they're home and they're settling in, getting ready to go back to school. The teachers are getting ready to go back to school. We've had our vacation and now we're just laying around the pool drinking pina coladas. This is the month. Take some time. Maybe take a sick day from work. Stay home. Invite your girlfriends over to the house. August is a happy happens month. It's the month where everybody's supposed to be happy. Call up a few girlfriends and say, come on over, let's have coffee. Maybe make it 10. You don't have to do it at the quack of dawn. I just went to the grocery store. I bought fresh bagels. I bought some coffee cakes. In the old days, I've been, I would have made them. But you know what? You don't have to make them. They just want a place to come and to sit around and just commiserate on what their life is like. And at the end of the day, when they all leave, and take their troubles away with them, you're going to go, boy, am I happy. I got what I got. It always, I always felt it made me feel better. Everybody has problems. Everybody rocks a rocky road periodically. But in August, we got to look for the happy. August is also headed up. August 1st is girlfriend days. And that's why it's the time to play with your girlfriends. It's a time to enjoy, and I think that's what quacking is all about. You can invite quackers over, but why not just invite other people over and share our quacky spirit, share the joy that we have in our hearts. We're one of the blessed people in this world because we know what happy's all about. It's also the month they have a, it's, I think it's August 8th or something like that, it's garage sale day. It's a good time to clean out the cupboards again. You know, your mother used to do fall house cleaning. I wouldn't get carried away. I'm not of the vintage that's going to put the rugs out on the back uh, clothesline and pound them with a stick. But it's a good time to empty out some of those nooks and crannies that have sort of built up over the summer. Remember, your trash is somebody else's treasure. So why not make yourself a little extra money? You know, might buy you another Quaker sweater. You just never, never know. And I think one of the best days of August is August 22nd. August 22nd is Angel Day. And I have to tell you guys, every one of you are angels in my life. You are the bonus to my business. I didn't expect this when I started Quacker Factory. Each one of you are an angel on earth, and we all help each other through every day. So on August 22nd, maybe that's the day to have your girlfriends over. Make a halo out of tin foil and a pipe cleaner. Give everybody their own halo. Make an angels. Get some fake feathers and, you know, make a pair of wings for one of them. Put some joy in this month. That's what it's all about. We're trying to make the website a little bit more fun. Now, I realize it's not as interactive as we want it yet, but if you look, we have a whole new look, and we're playing around with it, and we're trying to get it so that it will be a little more interactive. We have Joe on there now. We have Lee on there doing In the Jeans. We also have Jenny, who is the quack in London, and Jenny is doing her little column so I want all of you to go in and meet Jenny and see what she has to say from the London Quackers. And I'm hoping that the London Quackers will click on to it and hear what the American Quackers are doing. It's sort of love across the sea. So I just think that we're doing lots of exciting things on, on the website. 
Also, we're going to start putting pictures on the website, so if you start sending me pictures with a little note saying, I, I, I'd be thrilled if you use it on the website, and if you can do it electronically, we'd be thrilled. I just got pictures from some of the gals that have been to our live audience show, and I'm going to put those on. I also, um, two of the quackers, if you look in the pictures of my brother's memorial service in Wisconsin on June, you'll see Ruth Smith and, and uh, Eve LaTulip. They have the same quacker outfit on at the party. Uh, I'm going to put pictures of quackers in quacker outfits on the website. I, I went out to dinner the other night. There are two good friends that I go to dinner with every couple weeks. And I've known them for 20, 30, 30 some years. And we just, we, we get together about 6 o'clock at night and we seem to close the restaurant at about 11.30, you know, at night. We, I don't know where we find them much to talk about. But anyhow, we, um, I'm going to have those pictures are on the website. Go look at those. Eleanor and, and Doreen are best friends in the whole world and Doreen gave me a pan of brownies for my birthday and her, they're her famous caramel brownies and I put those on there so you have the recipe I'm going to tell you in the words of my children they are num togs so this is August this is happy happens month this is the month to let it all hang out to have fun Brew up a good cup of tea or a good cup of coffee and invite your friends over and just enjoy life. Have a happy August. It's a Happy Happens Month. Bye-bye.